Right! Perfect! Oh, the sound always fucks up at this beginning. I found out. I found this out. Okay, so, uh, yeah. This, this should be the last part. We should be able to kill the boss in this chapter. Uh, really, really happy about this. This has... This chapter has been giving me so many hard times, and I've uh, finally been able to beat it. Well, I'm not gonna say I'm able to beat it yet, because, yeah, well, you know, anything can happen in fucking Fire Emblem. Okay, so let's see what this chain contains. Ooh, a barrier. Oh, that's shiny. And it gives me a chance to send the red gem. Ooh, very, very shiny indeed. The barrier is really, really good. It is uh, a staff, basically, that you can use on another unit to give it resistance. It's like a pure water. Uh, not that you know what that is if you don't know what the barrier staff is. Basically, yeah, you, you, you can use one of your healers to give one of your units seven extra magic defense. And every single turn uh, the, after you cast it, it, it goes down by one point. So basically it protects you for seven turns. Really, really good to have when you're fighting magic users. Oh, it's so good. Beautiful stuff. Okay. Uh, I'm a little bit unsure about this, actually. I'm gonna go check if I can't kill the guy with the Silver Lance first. Nope, I can't. However, I can do this. It's not a guaranteed chance I'll hit, though. And if I don't hit, I'm not so sure what I'm gonna do. Uh, let's let's uh, try to... Okay, so... This guy kills lot. Basically. That's not good. Um... <laughs> yeah, that's actually not good at all. What if I don't use the axe? Does he kill a lot if I don't use the axe? No, he doesn't. That's pretty good. Yeah, I'm just gonna use the iron axe then. Maybe I can even use the killer axe. Does he two shot a lot if I use the killer axe? Nope, he doesn't. That's perfect. Let's use the killer axe. Aha! Two. Wow. Awesome. Beautiful. Okay, that's that's great. Um cool. Now I'm not too sure about this. I think I'm gonna switch to the Iron Lance. And I'm gonna get Ellen out of harm's way. At least that's my plan. I'm gonna place Marcus here. Because I want him to be safe. Or, no, 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 I don't want Marcus to be safe. I hate Marcus, but he can act as part of the wall off. Which I quite like. Now, hmm, Roy got a new rapier. I actually really like that. Um, probably gonna be sending Barrier. No, Barrier. <laughs> probably gonna be sending Barrier. I'm probably gonna be sending Noah over to give Roy that Barrier and use that Barrier again. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Use that rapier against the boss. Yeah, I am, cause um, cause I like the rapier. It's a cool weapon, and uh, I quite like the way Roy's been leveling up lately. And I'm gonna be sending Clarine with him, you know, just just because I can. And these two cavaliers, so they can keep building supports with Lord Roy. Lord Roy. Master Roy! And uh, Ellen is not wounded, she's just leveled hit points twice, so... <laughs> yeah, go figure. Now, I actually think I wanna have... I wanna go and finish this guy with Lou. Hey, remember me? Well, just can't remember me anymore, cause you're, cause you're dead. Yeah. In your face. Yep. Let's, uh, I, I don't think any more reinforcements will spawn from the north. I'm pretty sure it's just the one. If, if I'm mistaken, then I'm fucked. But you know, I like to live dangerous. Yeah. And you can't even hit Marcus. You're useless. Look, he doesn't even use a weapon. He's pacifist Marcus. I fight with my shield. He's Captain America. Marcus should throw his shields at people. That would make me like him. Regardless of how crappy his stats are. That would really make him an awesome character. Okay, hello, rapier. Anyone order a rapier? Maybe an elixir. Okay, maybe you didn't, but uh, I did. Okay, Lord Roy, take the rapier, please. Uh, hey, soldier, just gonna kill you now. 
no personal issues, just, you know, you were in the way. So, yeah. I hope you had a nice life as a soldier and all. It's like... It was pretty boring being a soldier. It's like, hey, you're a soldier, go die on these guys. Because that's what they do. They they die on, on people. Like, okay, so I'm gonna use my horse slayer and hope I hit. Because if I don't hit, I'm pretty pretty ball. Actually, balls can take two hits from a, from a silver lance. And he hits, so I'm all good. Ouch, that silver lance hits so hard. Suppose that cavalier has a lot of strength too. They they have a lot of strength. Yeah, look at those stats. He's level 15. Wow. And this guy. These guys are level 7, and this guy's level 15, that's why he hits like a fucking truck. He's a level... You know what? I want to do a comparison with my, my, with my Cavaliers. Lance. Strength 12. Strength 14. Stre skill 14. Skill 11. Speed 15. Speed 10. Luck 8. Luck 6. Defense 10. Defense 9. Rest 2. Because that's pretty funny. This guy is a hard mode cavalier, level 15. Lance is level 13, and he actually is much better than this guy. So that I'm pretty happy. Think about hard. The reason why I did that it may sound really ridiculous, but the reason why I actually did that was because I was actually interested in knowing uh, if the hard mode characters were better than me, because they usually are. That's why I need so much strategy to kill them. Oh. That was a really good level up, because he gained skill. You know, Lot has a lot of skill for a fighter. What he doesn't have is strength. That really bugs me. I wish he would level up strength more. Now, I only need to pick up these villages, and I'm ready to go. Shall I take one turn in the arena? No. 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 Sorry. I'm refusing to do that. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just that the arena kills me. Oh look, it's a soldier. Be careful, General Egan says I hide with burn now. He went to slaughter all those who resisted him. But I saved my own hide. Please take this, it's proof for heroes. Give this to them and keep fighting to protect Ostia. Oh, this guy gives me a hero crest. That's beautiful. That's what you used to do to promote Rutger. Also, I, I was not going to say also, I was going to say awesome. Awesome, we are going to beat this chap. Da -da 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 -da. That was an appropriate change to music. Okay, we need an iron lance. We don't want a steel lance, because steel lances are terrible. But we need bows. One, two... Two bows. It's enough. And a steel bow. Even though I don't like them. Fine. Okay, we have spent a little bit too much gold this chapter, but, you know, who cares. Okay, Clarine. Keep supporting. Keep owning. And, uh, yeah. And... And the Tana! Like they say in Japan. Japanese. J like they say in Japanese. Yep. Yeah. Like they say in the Japanese versions of Fire Emblem. Tan and the! I actually played an entire Fire Emblem game in Japanese with my friend. Uh, it was pretty funny. Rapier! And, uh. Oh. Yes. I'm going to try to use Roy to kill this guy off. I think I should be able to manage it with Clarine's healing. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna pick up the last item and uh, we're, we should be good. Balls. Horse Slayer, just because I can. You know, I'm not the kind of person who saves my weapons a lot. I'm like the kind of weapon who just likes to use weapons because they're funny. Because at the end of Fire like I used to be a guy who saved everything I had. But the thing is, I found that at the end of each Fire Emblem game, I always like sat with countless weapons that I've been saving up. Like, like 15 Killing Edges, 5 Halberds. You know, I just had so many weapons that I didn't use, because I was like, oh, I'm going to save them, I'm going to save them for the occasion, and then I just never used them. And that really sucked, so after that, I was, I kind of became like the more like, oh, a cool weapon? Let's use that weapon right now, guy. Because, you know, it's, it, what the fuck is, do you need weapons for if you're not going to use them? You know, use them. If you get a halberd, go find some cavaliers and smack them. That's what they're for. That's what the game does, you know, it's fun. Okay, Willich check. Willich taken, 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 taken. Only one left. Let's go there. I totally missed your first line. Here's something that can cure injuries from a distance. If Lady Lena is hurt, please help her. Yeah, this this is the physics stuff. As you can as you can see, the healers I killed earlier on used uh, physics stuff, which is a really really good stuff, mind you. 
Alright, let's uh, send Roy on this guy, shall we? Ouch, he hits hard. <laughs> Ow, okay. Calm down. Oh, did I heal Roy? I healed Roy, didn't I? Thank you. Yeah, blah blah blah, I won't let you pass, that's what he said. <laughs> I was, uh, for a moment there I was like, did I forget to heal Roy? Oh my god. Because that would have been terrible. Yeah, he's gonna die next turn. Support check. I know that Lot has to support with bars, balls, ball, 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 and I, I think these two have a support. Ellen, you, yeah, won't be any time to support, I suppose. Dorothy, you suck. Go away. Oh, what? What? There's more of them, really? I was pretty sure they'd be okay. Fine, I'll just kill you guys and kill the boss then. I'm pretty sure if you kill the boss, the reinforcements stop. That's usually how it works in Fire Emblem. And you know, just because I am so awesome, I'm just gonna finish off the boss as quickly as I can. Cause you know what? I'm tired of this chapter. I am not interested in playing this chapter anymore. I am done with this chapter. So if I die on these horses now, I'm gonna scream. This is why I'm gonna play it ultra safe. Blue, get away! Oh shit! Okay, he can. He, so he will actually attract this guy. Uh, yeah, he has a defense of six, but he'll be good. So yeah, ouch! This this isn't too good, is it? Iron axe and lot. In the forest, he should be pretty good. And uh, horse layer on balls. Paladins ready for rescue duty. Healer tucked away nicely behind the front ranks. Merlinus chatting with Dorothy, the useless archer. Suck, by the way. And uh, yeah, let's let's finish this guy off, shall we? Hello, taste my rapier. Pow pow. Taste it again. How about the? And uh, you know, I'm gonna do like this. I'm gonna heal Roy up and then rescue him and get him away from the fray. Does Clarine have pigtails? She doesn't. Why does she have pigtails in her sprite? She doesn't have pigtails. I'm gonna do that. I don't care what anyone says, pigtails is incredibly sexy. No, it's not about liking little girls. Pigtails is a sexy hairstyle. It is! My, all my friends are like, oh, she would like little girls. No! I just like pigtails, they're cool. You don't have to like little girls. Okay, why am I getting sidetracked? Let's kill this guy. And... Coup de gras! Through the neck! General Lagos, please be careful. These people are strong. They managed to beat the hardest chapter in the game. Oh. Level up. Good level up. I like this. Okay. Now whatever you do, do not fail on these cavaliers. Please, God. Do not fail. Okay, I think we're good. These other cavaliers can't do anything to balls. They do something, but not enough. Oh, shit. I think I... <laughs> I knocked... <laughs> I knocked over something. I was a little bit excited there. I need to stop waving my hands around. Yeah, so Balls is pretty much gonna finish off every one of these. <laughs> the Horse Slayer is such an amazing weapon. Just like the Halberd, you know, it's really good against horses. So yeah, next turn, kill those two Cavaliers. End fucking chapter. Oh my god, this feels so good. This feels amazing. Oh my god, we finally beaten this fucking chapter. Die! Last Cavalier. You're next. Hope you enjoyed your life as a cavalier, because it's about to end. I'm going to kill you with the regular Iron Lance, because you're not worth the hassle. Da. Okay, you kind of ruined my moment there, last cavalier. But you know what? Last cavalier, you're going to get the honor of dying at the hands of... Oh wait, he doesn't have a weapon. You're going to get the honor of dying the hands of Marcus with the javelin. Goodbye. I'm glad you didn't dodge that, because that would have made me look really stupid. Yeah.
it's about time we fucking capture this throne. Goodbye. Chapter 7. May we never play again. I am really tempted to stand up and shout now. But it's 5 o'clock in the morning and my neighbor is sleeping. My cat is also lying here. So I'm just gonna do this smoothly. Da, 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 da. We beat chapter 7 finally. Oh, I am so happy. Cause chapter 7 is a fucking hard chapter. Oh yeah. But I'm gonna spoil something. This is not the hardest chapter in the game. This is by far not the hardest chapter in the game. I was reading a little bit of strategy yesterday, and uh, I must say, we have some really hard chapters in front of us. All chapters in this game is really hard, because it's a really hard game. So don't think that just because we beat chapter 7, there's no challenge left. Oh no, I'm going to get frustrated, I'm going to shout, I'm going to scream, and there's going to be lots of fail montages, I'm sure of it. But we have beaten the first really, really hard chapter in this game, and it, it's really sweet relief for me. Because I know, okay, the next chapters, they're gonna be hard, they're gonna be hard, I'm gonna struggle with them, but not as much as I would, not as much as this one. However, there is one particular chapter which we, you will see, I think it's chapter 17 or 18, it's gonna be hell on earth. I'm not sure if I'm even gonna be able to complete it, we'll see when I get there. For now, let's enjoy the story. Okay, the city should be under control by now. Now we have to recapture Castle Austin and rescue Lilina. Lilina. Asteroy, we are currently breaking down the gate to enter the castle. I understand that you want to get in quickly, but we are working as fast as we can, so please be patient. Lilina. Speaking of Lady Lilina, what do you think of Lord Hector's story, Asteroy? You mean about the dragons? Oh, they weren't myth. They were real. Lord Hector is one of the greatest battle, battle tacticians in Lycia, and his army was decimated in such a short time. Well, Baron's army is among the strongest in the Lieb. I say those Dragon Knights are indeed very formidable op opponents. Of course the Dragon Knights must have been tough enemies, but the real dragons, I can't even imagine how powerful they must be. The weapons that are effective against dragons, I wonder where they are. I presume they must be the divine weapons. So if we use those weapons, we can fight the dragons e efficiently? But I wonder what a divine weapon is doing in Ostia. Perhaps Lady Lelina knows that, hmm, I do wish to know as well. Oh, Master Roy, the men has finished knocking down the gates. We can enter now. Alright, charge! We'll rescue Lelina and slaughter all the innocent healers in the palace! Woo! Oh yeah. I am going to sleep. I'm gonna sleep very well tonight. My name is Vin Manx, I love you all. I'll see you next time. Yeah, this is the part where I stop recording.